What's up everybody? I'm Colleen. I'm Natasha. And I'm Joshua Rush. You're wondering if he even knows you're there. Or cares. Yes. I know exactly how you feel. And we're gonna answer some of your fan questions. Will Cyrus actually learn to dance or not? You'll have to wait and see. <laughs> um, but but there was a lot of there was a lot of sweat shed. Kind of like threw you into it, right? Yeah, they did not tell me anything, and we didn't actually even get to rehearse. <laughs> um, so that that dance scene, what you're seeing there, authentic. is very authentic <laughs> because they didn't let me in the room. There were all the real dancers back there who had been choreographing for like a week and preparing for that scene and everything. Yeah. And I'm just kind of chilling, like, okay. Uh, and they let me in. They go roll sound, roll camera. The cameras go, and they're like, okay, action, and the, the music goes, and I'm like, okay, here I go. Oh, oh my god. <sighs> Truly nothing more relatable than when you're like, I made a mistake. <laughs> I am bad at dancing. <laughs> Sum up Aunt, season three of Andy Mack in three words, and that's from Hope Thompson. Live, love, laugh. Um, Hope Thompson, season three of Andy Mack, man, and we're not even done shooting it, so I don't have everything. <laughs> Um, but wild, absolutely, because um, there are a lot of twists and turns. I'm buying time trying to figure out what my second word is going to be. <laughs> um, man, love. I think that there's there's a lot of there's a lot of there's a lot of uh, hearts brought together and a lot of hearts broken. So you'll have to wait and see on that. And uh, exciting, I think, because there's a lot of. Exciting new things that are going on that no we haven't ever covered on Andy Mac before and there is One really exciting storyline that I think we've I've alluded to mm -hmm. and Peyton's alluded to mm -hmm. in an interview with you before um, That is really really exciting and I'm excited that we're gonna get to show that off so exciting like I've said seven times in that <laughs> sentence Aww, So exciting. That's nice. It's like when I infomercial and I'm still excited. And it's so <laughs> exciting. Oh, oh wait, there's more <laughs> And then over the weekend, I saw you like three times in one day or whatever yeah. it was on Sunday. It was I, wild. I was like, we were following you. We should, we should have just carpooled together to everything that was we going on over the weekend. Um, but we were talking about the interview that I did with you guys, and there was a couple parts to it, and like I loved each one. Like when I was, I was like crying when I was editing it. Like I, that doesn't happen. And um, and it was really interesting because I really didn't expect the reaction to like the ship question and all that stuff. And you were telling me this weekend, you're like. Um, you should check out Tumblr. Like, and I searched why I speak out Tumblr earlier today. We're in GIFs. There's GIFs of us, so thank you to whoever GIFs? made that. GIFs. Yes. GIFs. I, I yes. GIFs. Oh, GIFs. GIFs. Okay. It is GIF. It's officially it's GIF, but yeah, it's like that's a brand of peanut butter. You know? I agree. Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. I'm old. I'm old. You know. No, I'm, it, I'm you're a, correct. <laughs> is the thing. Yeah. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a GIF purist, so um, <laughs> yeah. See, I'm rebelling against it. And, and mm -hmm. so this question is from Megan G H C Ryland, and she says. I love this. How do you feel about the fact that people have created such close friendships online through Andy Mac? It's kind of crazy, cause like, and I, and I say it a lot, but we're out there, we're back in Utah, kind of disconnected from this crazy LA world and like the, the politics, for lack of a better word, of LA. And, and we're just kind of doing our jobs and we're just hanging out and being friends and doing our lines and everything. But there are real people in the real world who are being really affected by the stuff that we're doing back there. Whether it be people who have the courage to come out as a result of Andy Mack. And there are people in my Instagram DMs, and I read every single one of my DMs, uh, it, who talk about that and I try to respond to that. I have like 10 backlogged that I want to respond to. Um, but like, there are real people out there who are making friends as a result of it, who are like having these passionate arguments as a result of it. And we're just kind of chilling like, okay, wow. <laughs> wow, like it's crazy, yeah. the, 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 the breadth of everything that happens. Another question came in, and I want to look it up so we can kind of give everybody a shout out, but I, it was, it's like basically even the year anniversary of the coming out episode. Yeah. Wow. And, and I loved yeah. it when, when we talked about the, most, the scenes that were the most meaningful to you, and that, that scene was just like so incredible, and the fact that you, you saw that it was like such a responsibility that you had and you guys acted so beautifully in that scene. I know the day, yeah, wow, that's wild. Wow, a year. Yeah, um, right? 
the day that that press release came out, October 24th, um, that, that we were going to have a gay character, um, which I know is not the anniversary of the actual scene mm -hmm. itself, but it is the anniversary mm -hmm. of knowing that this was going to happen and, and the world knowing. I, we were, we were, I was choreographing. I was getting ready for the bar mitzvah dance scene, <laughs> which took like four hours of choreography, and we knew that the press release was going to drop at 3 p.m. We knew where it was going to drop. We knew like the link that it was going to come out on. And I was just like clicking. And I was like, it was 2.59 p.m. and my phone ran out of battery. Oh no! It was awful! Oh. And so I had wow. to run, like run back, because the we were doing, it was in a mall that we shot the bar mitzvah. No way! I didn't like know that! Like a huge mall with like a banquet hall yeah. in it. And that's where the bar mitzvah was okay. shot. Um, the bar mitzvah, the, the party was shot. And I was in like an abandoned store yeah. doing the choreography and preparing for that with the choreographer. And I ran across this mall to where we were shooting so yeah. I could borrow somebody's phone <laughs> to like see this press release come up. And I got there just in time to take someone's phone and get the Hollywood Reporter notification Disney Channel will have its first gay character. Like, what? Oh, what so a amazing. crazy moment! So, so yeah. cool. On a lighter note, somebody asked if if you were gonna be on, I guess in the season three trailer, there you were on a motorbike. <laughs> Are we gonna get to see that? No comment. No comment. Okay. No we're comment. Gonna, okay. 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 Maybe. Maybe nope. not. <laughs> and by the way, I don't know if we mentioned this, but he literally like we reached out to his person this morning, like let's set up an interview in the next couple weeks. But I and I literally got a call five minutes later, and it's like. He can do it on the way to the airport. <laughs> so like, like he my suitcase is like right over there. I'm about to leave the yeah. airport. Yeah. Oh my god! Wait, wait! I have never heard this. Abby wants to know what do you think of the fan theory that TJ and Amber are siblings? Have you, you heard, heard of that? Theory? The Kippen what? twins too. What? The I Kippen never... twins theory? I've never heard I of that. I love that theory. <laughs> and we... Who came up with that? I don't know, but that's insane. I wow. that's so. Great. It's never been broached before on the show, but God, it's my personal head. And they look alike. Like, it doesn't matter what I actually think, but like, yes, I love that theory. <laughs> wow. Um, oh they look God. alike, they're both, I mean, not really, they're just both blonde. Um, True. But like, they both have like this mean thing about them when you first meet them, but they're kind of nice when you peel back those yeah. layers. Yeah. And, oh God, I love that yeah. theory. Yeah, I like that about And them. there's fan fictions about it too. No! There was a great I have to get into Tumblr. Like, I feel like it's hard to navigate sometimes. Like I can't find it always, but I'm trying. There's so much on Tumblr. I like know. there was a yeah. Okay. I've seen yeah. your Tumblr before. Like I haven't looked at it in a while because I just don't know Tumblr sadly. But I'm so you're a riot when you answer questions. It's, it's not great. Right. Right. I think I did a story once just about like your funniest moments, and I used everything. Yeah. Somebody from that. asked like how much do you enjoy messing with people. Um, <laughs> I'm a bad person. Like, nothing that I say, especially on Tumblr, should be taken at face value. <laughs> um, okay, this is a good one. Uh, at person going slow wants to know, what has it been Love like- that <laughs> What has it been like to work with Luke? Oh, Luke is awesome. Luke is such a sweetheart. We just, just had him in here and he was hilarious. No, he's just such a kind, like, amazing soul yeah. and just such an awesome- I feel so lucky to be able to work with him and to be able to hang out with him and he has a driver's license which is fantastic. Because uh -oh. <laughs> everyone's draw I'll, I'll like call when I'm in LA and I'm bored and I have nothing to do and I'm yeah. to study. He lives uh, a couple towns north and I'll just call him and be like, hey you wanna drive down and study? And he'll be <laughs> oh like, God. yes, I'm on my way and I'll, he'll be like there in an hour and a half and we'll hang out and we'll go and eat and we'll just like spend time yeah. together. Yeah, when he was here, he was like, oh, I think I'm gonna go hang out with Josh after this. Yeah. yeah. But well, we had him do the, the head turn and recreation. I love you yeah. so <laughs> <laughs> Is that the same music? Yeah. Oh, my so God. good. <laughs> so gonna post this on our Instagram. So <laughs> oh, good. Uh, at Luke is a toughy. Did you know that Tyrus was gonna be a ship when TJ was first introduced? Walk to the muffin like you already own it. He can't do that. Hey, don't tell him what he can't do. Dancing with Danger is on my bucket list. So to a certain extent, we knew that TJ was coming on, but I don't think any of us knew uh, the extent of what was happening with his character, and none of us knew, because at that time, Jairus was like everything. Yeah. So 
everyone was only thinking about that, so yeah. it was it was not really too high up in the mind, especially because we just don't know what's gonna happen. Yeah, until don't we know. know. Yeah. That must be fun though. Just, I like kind of not. It's annoying. awful. <laughs> I like. I really like um, you and um, Buffy, and I like love the trio of you guys. Yeah, so I think it's a like, really funny. It's 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 almost like you guys as actors, because I saw a comment this morning that was like. My favorite thing about the Indie Mac cast is that they just act like teenagers. Like you we guys are. Really, yeah, but like, you know, in real life, you just like hang out. And it's, you know, a lot yeah. of cast are like, we're best friends. But like, you guys you are, are actually best friends, yeah. which is yeah. so cool. And I think shooting in Utah has a big, big um, effect on that. Like, we are, we're, we're like far away from everyone else. Yeah. And we try and hang out with them as much as we can, but we're not in LA that often. It's a different mm -hmm. vibe. You're like going to events and Yeah, it's carpets. totally different. And when, it, when we're in Utah, the thing is, we are just teenagers. Yeah. Like as much as we talk about, like yeah, we're on this TV show, and like yeah, we get to do all this cool stuff. But yeah, we're just we're just teenagers, and we just hang out. And like, if we want to ha have sleepovers and just have fun with one another, we will. Yeah. We're, we're just we're just regular guys, really. That's fun. Who's the first to fall asleep at the sleepover? Me. <laughs> Although, it, it, it's it's changing to a certain extent. It used to be like, I used to like be done at 9 p.m. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm boring What time that. did the sleepover start? The sleepover started at like, okay. like when we get off set at okay. like 2 p.m. <laughs> That's when the sleepover starts and then like we'll hang out. Yeah. And then, but like, it, I'll be in bed at 9. Sophia will be to bed at like 11, 11.30, and Peyton and Ash are like, what? It's 7 a.m.? What? That's so funny. I'm fixing that. It's getting better. <laughs> You're like, I'm waking up once coffee. If I get, yeah. if I get like a 10 p.m., like, <laughs> if I get like 10 hours of sleep one night, I'll be able to go till like 2 the next night, but like, I can't deal. I like that. You're making me feel young. <laughs> Awesome. Um, well, we don't want you to miss your flight. Yeah. yeah. You can't film. I need to get out of here. Thank you for show. coming. Like, well, you're awesome. Thank you for so much. And, um, yeah, we're super excited to get this up. Super excited to have you here. And super excited for new episodes More in season Max. three. So, um, Fridays, 8 p.m. Yeah. Disney Channel. Change don't forget to, to follow me at Joshua Rush everywhere and on Instagram at News That Rush, my new series. Yeah. You're, you're so beautiful now. Peace.